Hey guys, Bryceoff here, and welcome back to Lemmings on the Super Nintendo Entertainment System. It's your Super Nintendo Entertainment System. I'm sorry, that's that's a little silly. Let's get on with level 8 of fun, not as complicated as it looks. It could be fun? Uh, hopefully. Okay, first of all, we got all these skills. The exit's right here, we're exiting here, but we're going to run this way. So let's see what we got to do. So we can go over here, we'd have to build a couple bridges, and have to bridge across this, and across that, up to that wall. In the meantime, we're going to have to find a way to distract everybody so they don't fall in the water. We have to save 95%. This is going to be tough. So let's get ready to go here. Okay, so we need to get to our bridges. Right, bridges, yeah. Or we can just do that. That would probably be the smarter move. Just put the blocker on, and let them all walk in. You know, there's probably a way to actually save 100% here, but I'm rarely lazy and I don't want to figure it out, so... To hell with that. Probably have to do with, like, mining into the ground here and getting other guys mining and then building bridges to stop them from mining through the bottom. And just find a way to make them turn around and get all of them to the exit. But to hell with that, this guy can just do the sacrifice for everyone. And he can just sit there ready to bomb himself into oblivion. Nod your head no all you want. You're dying. That's the rule. I made the rules and so did you, or something like that. I don't know. All I know is that we got 99%. Well, I hope it's no problem. It's fun level 8, for God's sakes. Once we get a failure, we'll get a pretty good message. As long as you try your best. We gotta save 90% out of 100, so... 10 lemmings can die. Okay. Again, they're giving us all kinds of skills to play with just so we can get used to them. And it's a 99 release rate. This could be a problem. Let's actually... Can I? I wonder if I can put a blocker down right away. Yeah, and they can walk through it. Okay. That's, again, something picked up from Roundy. So we'll see. Now, that means we'll save everyone but that one guy. Because these things here... They will rip your lemmings up with their big fiery swingy arms of doom. I'm not sure what kind of trap that would even be. Now, if I bomb this guy ahead of time, it would actually... This area is so narrow that these guys would just start falling right into the soup. And I can't afford that. I can't afford to just have that happen. Because I need 90%. Otherwise, I would demonstrate that and we'd all laugh at them dying in the in that gross-ass green. Bomb yourself into oblivion, buddy boy. Bomb yourself into oblivion. <laughs> See, they would have fell right in there. And they would have been like... I don't, I don't know if they make any noise in this version. Again, I'm sure we'll find out. Alright, on to level 10. And there's only 30 levels per rating. Smile if you love lemmings. You can't see it, but I've got like a chest tire cat sort of... On my face right now. It's pretty good. Alright. So these guys are going to start falling in here pretty quick. So what do I want to do? I guess I could do it this way? Actually, I wonder if I could do this and not do something completely dumb. Could be fun. Let's see. Okay, let's get a floater going here. Oh god, that was really close to not happening. <laughs> I guess I also could have just done a blocker and a blocker and then dug down and... But, you know, where's the fun in that? Oh god, that guy's getting out. No, 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 no. We gotta save as many as our little buddies as possible. Alright, and you can't apply skills when you're paused. That's one thing you can't do in this game. And you can't even up the release rate. That's kind of silly, Billy. And let's just get them all in there as quickly as possible. Alright, so we can just dig our way the whole way down here. We, uh... I was thinking maybe we'd have to bash to the side and then start digging so that the guys who were coming out wouldn't fall too far and die, but they all got in there before they ever got close to splat height, so... Where's the fun in that? Yeah, bash your way out. Don't even, probably don't even need that blogger. Oh, look at these guys, still going. <laughs> no, don't go back in the hole. Alright, fine, everyone else escaped. Oh good, this time I got the digger. I guess if you aim right for the middle, it'll probably highlight the digger. So that he'll be the one. And we made ourselves a weird kind of street design here. It's, it's all good. It's all relevant. That kind of looks like a thumbnail, this right here, the, the, the exit. Am I the only one seeing like a, a, a thumbnail? Um, I, I don't mean like a picture, I mean like the nail on your thumb. Probably just me. Alright, let's move on. Level 11. <laughs> what is level 11? Keep your hair on, Mr. Lemming. We gotta save 50 out of 60. Alright, so... We will have to put a climber... 
And I suppose we can also make him a, uh, a floater. Now, when you make them a climber and a floater, they will become what's known as an athlete, which means they will be able to do two skills at once. So I guess that makes their, them athletic. Now, I'm going to try something here. Can I use a miner on steel to turn around? No. It just straight up tells me I cannot. Now, here's what I got to do. I got to build over the exit. That's the plan, right? Yeah, I'm just going to try to build it. Hopefully he doesn't go in the exit, because if he does, then I've already got my first failure. I'm not 100% familiar with how everything works in this game. Don't go in the exit. Don't go in the... Don't. Just don't. Just don't. Build. Build. Good. Good. Once he builds past, I'll build to the wall, and he'll probably turn... It depends if he builds into the wall, he'll turn around, but if he builds right to the side of it, he'll actually climb up the top here. But he needs to build a little more. And now he's just going to turn around. Good man. Don't go in the exit. Good man. Let's get a basher going. And I didn't actually explain this, but it, it's pretty self-explanatory. See how there's arrows in this wall? You can only bash or mine through a wall in the direction that it's showing. And I don't think mining through arrow walls works all that well. So could be a problem in the future. Maybe. Regardless, we couldn't go this way like you want. See? These guys are trying to bash into that wall, but they can't make any uh, headway. Maybe they made a bit of headway. It's hard to say. Actually, I think they may have actually made a bit of headway. <laughs> yeah, they definitely made some headway into that wall that they shouldn't have. <laughs> That's hilarious. Anyway, we now need to deal with this bridge, which is now, of course, a problem because it's covering the exit. So we got lots of skills for that. So let's just go nuts. Yeah! Mind your way through, boys. There we go. Come on, you boys. Meanwhile, over here, this guy. Whee! He's going to take a sweet-ass time getting over here. Well, it'll be all right. Do I want to wait for him to walk that far? It'd be good to know how far he can walk in that amount of time. One screen length is going to cost him about... It's a pretty straight walk. He started about there at 10, so... It's probably close to 20 seconds for a Lemmings to w walk from one side of the screen to another. That's good to know for the future, because again, there's going to be some nasty stuff ahead to get us. Oh man, time-intensive levels. They are going to be a thing. Patience. Not my strong suit, as many people know. i got to save 50% of the Lemmings here, and it's a re release, release rate of 99. Alright, we're not starting uh, with the entrance in mind, so interesting. All right, so I guess we're going to want to set a blocker trap. This is something that's pretty common. All right. And... All right, so one more got through that I wanted, but that's okay. And we'll just let them trap themselves all nice and neat. And we'll put that guy to work. And we'll get ready to build a bridge here and get across. We could also, I guess, technically I didn't need to even trap them, I guess. I could have just built out of here, but... Building out of a hole with a bunch of lemmings in it is not fun. Ah, that was dumb. Oh well. Let's get building. This is London Bridge just falling down, I know that. <laughs> and yeah, the one thing... Well, the one thing. The big thing I'm going to struggle with is just where to build bridges from. Now, can I just build this and get up? Oh wow, that actually is walkable? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Apparently it is. Awesome. I suppose I could try to save these guys, but to hell with that. Let's just get this bombed out of here. And it's slowed down a little. There's too much stuff walking together. We're lagging a little. Oh no! Everyone get out. <laughs> I just love when they Oh no! They're so cute as they die horribly. <laughs> That's a really misshapen um, boob impression or butt, depending on how you want to look at it. I still can't believe they made it up that. This actually is slowed down because they're so mangled together. Oh god. It just it kinda looks like like short um short front property there with like the waves crashing up on the greeny grass. I don't know. Maybe I'm crazy. Maybe I'm insane. Either or is perfectly acceptable. Let's move on. Level 13 is we all fall down. This is going to be a repeated meme in this game. We have to save 100%. Oh, it's going to be a grand old time in the pain of my butt, that's for sure. Alright, let's do that. 
So basically, they're going to walk along here, and if they let them go right to the end, they will fall from a height that's just a bit too high, and they will die. Depressing as that is. This level's going to repeat itself three more times with more and more lemmings, and you're going to have less and less room here to make them do um, good stuff. And by good stuff, I mean fall from a proper height. So we may as well get our practice in now and try to do it from as close to the end as possible. This is a level where pausing comes in handy extremely often. Interesting music for this. And I wonder if I can let them just walk right off and live. Oh, uh, they're... Oh, crap. Well, he's okay, actually. I'm not even getting close to digging them at the spot they need. They basically need to overlap each other hard on the dig. Ah, that guy got off. Still, 39 looks like a pretty good set if I want to only use half the diggers. Because that is one option. You can let some go through. Like this. Let him go through and he'll live. And now that's what I can't, because he might hit that and turn around, and if they turn around, I think there's a hole over here for them to fall into. Yeah, so you can't leave a spot ahead of them that they might turn around on. But if they've got, like, the wide open, like, they dig here and there's nowhere else for them to turn around on, you can let them walk off. Like, 39 looked like it worked pretty good for that. I'll have to remember that. That was a good little release rate. There we go. We did it. Hooray! I'm sure there's a way to do that with even less diggers, you know, just because, well, I use 15 out of 20, but you know what I mean. You can do it with 10 out of 20 doing that style. All right, let's move on. Let's see what's going on. Origins and Lemmings. Hmm. Number of Lemmings, 80. We've got to save 75%. That would be 60 Lemmings to be saved. Let's see what we get. I love this architect. That kind of looks like a like a weird sort of dog train or like, a, you know, a, a dog centipede or like, if Birdo hooked up to a couple other Birdos, I don't know. Anyway, we got to get our boys all the way through here and get them getting going nice and fancy pants here. So, let's see. We got lots of skills, though, so it doesn't really matter. I don't think they can walk up over that edge of that thing, so we can have fun doing, uh... Let's do some mining. Mining's a little slower than bashing, but that's okay. Just to make sure they don't splat. Let's see if anyone's going to disappear on us here. I don't think they can climb up this, but if they can, we'll put a blocker up here. Come on now, can you climb up there? Nope. Awesome. Alright. Let's see what we got now. So, we got the build next. Probably start building from about, I don't know, like right here? Yeah, let's go right here. Probably could do it from a little closer. I just need to get up high enough so I can bash through this to the far side. It's gonna take a while, but we got six minutes. So we're not gonna get time crunched in this level. Oh, time crunch. Yeah, stretching the bridge, too. That's a skill that is also very um, useful to know, because it makes your bridges not go as high as fast, and they go out even further, so you save a bit of time. Now, you got to be careful bashing up against a wall with a bridge, because if you do it a little too early, you'll take out a pixel, and they'll fall down. And when you're over a gap, that means bad stuff for everyone involved. My, oh my. You do not want to be that guy. I mean, you, you might want to be that guy, I suppose, but it doesn't seem like a smart move to me. Let's just let these guys have a little more, a little more free reign here. There's no way to get up to 99 really fast, as far as I know. I don't think there is. But I could be crazy on that front, so, you know, whatever. Alright, good enough. Start building. Start building, Poncho Villa. Get yourself up there. Come on, now. And stretching that bridge out, that's a good thing to practice, I think. Uh, not as good as the last one, but it's slightly stretched. There's apparently variations of stretching of a bridge here, so that's good to know. Um, could one of you go through that? Thank you. Alright, that's, uh... No, no, don't. Wait. Cool, I can just... That's really annoying sounding, I bet. <laughs> and they're through to the exit. I think that'll be a good spot to stop today, so... After these guys march to the exit, we'll see what we're waiting for on level 15. What's the title we'll be facing in that insane traptude of batitude? And that's probably not real phrasing or words that I should ever put together. My, oh my, hi, in a pie. I, 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 I don't know. I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. It's, it's a sad day for dog racing, that's for sure. Come on, guys, get there already.
So there we go, 100%. I am the best in the land. And what are we doing next time? Don't let your eyes deceive you. It's really weird how they do the capitalization in this game. It really, really is. I'm sure there's a valid reason for it, but I'll be asked if I can think of what it is. Anyhow, we'll see you guys next time for level 15 of fun.